channel. Um, I'm going to be doing a little review on the handbag I'm uh, carrying at the moment and that would be my Dooney and Burke uh, vintage bag that I picked up for a steal and for $40 Canadian. So uh, I've been enjoying it the last couple of weeks and um, but I've decided I'm going to change out of that one today. Uh, first of all do a review on it uh, then change out of it and I'm changing into this bag here which I will reveal momentarily so here we go first of all um, this bag oh I have loved it it is uh, it's vintage um, not sure uh, how how old this bag is if anyone knows how old it is please let me know um, uh, yeah it does have the little Dooney and Burke um, solid brass uh, on a leather tab hanging down. Uh, front has no logo. The back has the logo. And right there. Messed up a little bit, but that's okay. I'm going to take, I still mean to take them into my, um, my uh, shoe repair man and uh, see if he can maybe buff it up a little bit and maybe take out a few of, a few of the scuff marks around the edges. But really, um, on a day-to-day -day wearing it, you don't even see these. Um, it's, got the, um, it's got the little clip here, which holds it. And I really love that, love that feature. I think it's really classy, looks great. Um, I have it just set up perfectly as crossbody and there we go and it looks just great just sits just perfect spot and i'll open her for you here we go and this is what i have been carrying in it um it is a smaller bag i'm used to a much larger bag uh and so i had to scale down and i wasn't able to put as much in this one as I normally would um, but I think it does you know it does hold quite a bit um, I have my my little um, charger as I always carry it and it's right in there extra charger for my iPhone and then I have my Dooney and Burke uh, makeup case which has the usual stuff in there, my cosmetics, my Vaseline, my Echinacea tabs, my perfume, lipsticks, lipsticks, and more lipsticks. And that's in there, so that carries quite a bit. And then I have been using my Red Wallet, which I'm loving. And I'm going to change out of that one into this one. And it's the Kenneth Cole, but we'll get to that in a second. So that's my wallet. That's also inside. And my sunglasses were inside. Uh, grocery store receipts. More cards loyalty cards, that sort of thing, my juicy fruit, winter wonderland hand sanitizer, and candies, more gum, tissues, list, grocery list, and a fabric sheet on the bottom because it did did have a smell when I first got it. It wasn't a bad smell, but it did have a vintage smell, and now it doesn't have any smell at all, nothing at all. And that's just one of those odor odor eater fabric sheets. Um, I haven't used this um, this part here, and it has a little zip there. On the back, I do love this pocket because that's for my um, glasses, to clean my glasses. I 
pop my keys in there and just another candy and that's it that's all I fit in there and I mean that's quite a lot so um, that's that one and I am going to change into it's Michael Kors and guess which one it is girls Ta -da. I haven't used this bag yet I don't know why for whatever reason I haven't used it I love it it's the same as my uh, luggage color it's exactly the same bag this one because I haven't used it yet is still quite a bit stiffer I'm amazed at the the one the luggage one which I used um, a lot of uh, it has softened down quite a lot and it's really really feels great now so this one is still a bit stiff uh, it's got the silver hardware and as I say I haven't used it yet so take out the stuffing and that is what it's like inside so you've seen the review of my other one so it's the same but let's see what we can well we can fit lots in here uh, the keys I will put on here and I'm going to change into this black wallet which is a Kenneth Cole I'll put that in here um, my Dooney and Burt makeup pouch my extra charger and my sunglasses my juicy fruit will fit in one of the pockets my iPhone uh, 5s will fit in the other pocket my um, my hand sanitizer now i can put this michael kors pouch in it and it's got more things in here like band-aids eye drops stuff like that so i can fit that in as well which is great and my loyalty cards i need that i'll put that in the pouch and pop my eyeglass cleaner in and so here we go and that's what's inside it's not overly stuffed beautiful zip this is my little handbag uh, hanger and you've seen this on my purses before I take it out with me uh, and if I don't have a chair to set my purse on, I use this to um, hook it onto the table and it just pops open here, opens all the way around and out. And this sits on the table and this piece hangs your purse. So it's a great little gadget. And you get used to them after a while how they work and let's see like that and my little roses with their little they are actually rose buds i believe someone said they looked like tulips uh, but it said in my, uh, when I bought them, it said that uh, they were roses. Anyway, doesn't matter. Um, I will put that on here. And it looks gorgeous with the gray. There we go. I'm ready. I am ready. This will look great with... A lot of my outfits that I'm going to be wearing in the month of December. Um, I've got uh, my gray fur jacket, my gray fur vest. Um, I have my gray um, suede high boots. 
I have my gray leather short boots and um, I have a lot of black and white and a punch of red will look great with the gray as well and then I can always change this out for um, red red or or winter white or whatever right so I'm all set girls and here we go that is the handbag I will be currently uh, sporting this month and thanks again ladies for um, checking in and I will see you all on the next video uh, take care and uh, don't let anyone dull your sparkle